Hello YouTube, this is Oppo. Now I will show you about an IC, IC555. This IC is known as a timer IC and you can do a lot of projects using this IC. This IC has 8 pins and pin 3 is our output. And you will get an output like this once high, then again low, again high, again low. So you will get an oscillation. And using this oscillation, you can do a lot of things. And you can also control the period of high and low. And I will show you later how to uh, control this time. So if you look at the internal construction of this IC, then you will see that there has uh, two comparator. Uh, three same value resistor, uh, one NPN transistor, and a SR flip flop. So now I am going to show you the circuit connection. Uh, so you need a 555 timer IC, two 10 kilo ohm resistor, 47 microfarad capacitor, and a LED light. So at first, make a short connection between uh, pin 4 and 8, then another short connection between pin uh, 2 and 6 make sure the, the two wires have no connection then a 10 kilo ohm resistor between pin 8 and 7 uh, and another 10 kilo ohm resistor uh, between pin 7 and 6 and a 47 microfarad capacitor between pin 1 and 2 uh, Make sure the negative terminal with pin 1 and positive terminal with pin 2. And uh, a LED light between pin 1 and 3. The positive terminal with pin 3 and negative terminal with pin 1. Then a battery connection to provide power in the circuit. A negative terminal with pin 1 and positive terminal with pin 4 or 8. I have done it in project board and here you can see the LED light is turning on and off and it is maintaining a certain period. I have also made a project a traffic light system and another project a thief detector using this timer IC. And I will show you how to do that in my another tutorial video. So now I will show you how to calculate the time. You just have to change the value of resistor and capacitor. Here are the equations uh, to calculate the time. T1 is our for T1 is for high output and T2 is for low output. T1 equal 0.693 into R1 plus R2 into C1 and T2 equal 0.693 into R2 into C1. And you can also calculate the total time T1 plus T2 and also frequency equal 1 by T. So make a nice project uh, using this timer IC and let me know about your project. That's all for today and uh, don't forget to make a comment about the video. Thanks for watching.